Hi, we're here today to do a would you rather video because, I don't know, why not? We did this like two, three years ago? Three years ago. A long time ago. Yeah. Well, if I can interject. Uh huh. It's like, because we watched the same video that inspired the first one again. That we is watched, true. We watched the Dan Phil PJ one and we were like, yeah. hey, let's do another one of these. That was really fun. Yeah. So, this is a thing. We're gonna pretend this is in another universe because I don't want to get arrested for slander. So, you just got hired to work a music festival. I don't know what the name of the music festival is. I didn't think that hard about this. So, whatever you want to call it, that's what it is. There are three headliners, and you can choose to help any of the three headliners as their assistant for the day until they go on stage, okay? So the three headliners are Coldplay, Ariana Grande, and Kanye West. So, there are some, there are some issues though. Each one of these artists has something... Anyway, each of these three artists has something terribly wrong with them. So Coldplay, fronted by the man, Chris Martin, if that is his real name, uh, has an, a really bad problem with his body. Excuse me. <laughs> anyway, if you are familiar with the hit song, Yellow, that, that lyric, it was all yellow, refers to his pee. He has this problem where he urinates constantly. It's like a steady stream of pee. Like, it's not just sometimes I piss myself. It's like, no, I am pissing all the time. <laughs> So, as your assistant, you have to change his diapers that are always on. You need to change Chris Martin's diapers if you oh, help Coldplay. Lord. Because that's just his body and he can't help it. He was born that way. He's never not peed. Nobody's really sure if it's actually pee. It's just a yellow stream of liquid constantly coming out of his body. So, that is what you must deal with if you are the assistant for Coldplay. Uh, and you have to deal with that until he walks off the stage and then you are free to go your merry way and he can go on his way peeing himself constantly. Then we have Ariana Grande. You may be familiar with her hit Dangerous Woman. She is actually a dangerous woman and she has this thing where she like really wants to kill people really bad and you have to like hold her back all the time. Like she will try to kill you. That's just her thing. Oh my god. So throughout the day you have to like keep her chained up you, cannot, <laughs> you can't let her look people in the eye you can't look her in the eye she will kill you all right okay you need to make sure she doesn't look anybody in the audience in the eye it's a it's a whole deal Good. the last person we have is mr kanye west you may be familiar with his song gold digger right so before every single show he demands that his assistant go out and dig him three buckets of gold <laughs> Before he goes on stage, he wants you to melt down these three buckets of gold, and he wants you to pour it over his naked body. That way, he like sucks in the gold through his pores, and he can like go out on stage and he can perform his very best. And he believes that he cannot do anything correctly until he is bathed in gold. However, the gold needs to be fresh. And this, this festival is not in California, but the gold needs to be from California, so you're gonna have to hop on a flight, you're gonna have to fly to California, dig that gold, pan for it, fly back, and bathe Mr. West. My question is, would you rather help the gorgeous little piss baby <laughs> keep Miss Grande from killing a man with her bare hands, or bathe Mr. Kanye West in gold that you have panned yourself? Party. The Kanye one, I would not actually put that past him. That is true, <laughs> yeah. The other ones, I'm sure they're lovely people. <laughs> if you're watching this, this was all a joke. I think you're great. Chris Martin, I hope you don't have that problem. You seem like a wonderful, nice man. Oh my god, I don't know. Those are horrible. I think I'd bathe Kanye. Okay. Reasons? Um, oh wait, where does the music festival take place? Because I want to know how long It takes place, let's, let's say it's like Reading and Leeds. So it takes place in, in England. In life. Oh, that the That's horrible. Yep. I know it is genuinely terrible. That okay, well, why. definitely not. Okay, Kanye. definitely not Kanye now. Maybe Ariana Grande, just because. Or Ar Ariana Grande. <laughs> not Ariana. But what is the difference? It's <laughs> Ariana, not Ariana. 
I think yeah, I, they're I think not I, do Eric, so. I think I do Ariana mm. because I don't know. She seems like the less grossest and like that's true. And like plus I really you don't have to get into her body. Yeah, uh, like you do with the other ones. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure she has like a nice body, but <laughs> I don't. Yeah, keep her clothes on, please. I think I think she would be the easiest. Like, yeah, because she's kind of a she's like a small human, right? Yeah. yeah, so she wouldn't be like horribly well, hard to like, restrain. Really fucking nice. So it's funny that you picked that she would kill someone. <laughs> Dangerous woman. It's a joke, Tara. You're a joke. That's true. <laughs> Wait, do you answer? Does the question asker answer the question as well? I mean, I can. Personally, I don't know. They're all terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I think I. <laughs> I wouldn't go with Coldplay because I don't like handling bodily fluids. Mm. That's like my- that's the bottom of the heat for me. I think... Uh, Ariana Grande I think would be the easiest because all you have to do is chain her up and make sure she doesn't like see anybody. Like you could even lock her in a closet. And Kanye, I just don't want to get that personal. So yeah, I guess, yeah, Ariana Grande. Yep. Yep. We all, yep. Went, with, yep. Yep. We all went with her. The dangerous woman. <laughs>